if you were to look at the rest of the whale family, you might be able to say that the rest of the whales are from Venus and, and, and the sperm whales are from Mars. Sperm whales are uh, the largest of the Adonisidae, the toothed whales, and indeed they are amongst the largest animals to occur in, in the world's oceans. They're also some of the most bizarre animals to occur. Uh, yeah, sperm whales are, are probably uh, the most abundant of all the large whales, and they're probably found over the most wide range, and that is that they're cosmopolitan in all the world's oceans, uh, occurring in, in tropical to temperate waters, uh, with adult males occurring in the high latitudes. Sperm whales are, are amongst the deepest divers uh, out there, and they, they forage at these tremendous depths, and they locate their prey by this fantastic echolocation system which they've developed over the eons. Sperm whales echolocate using sounds much in the same way that, uh, that humans use sonar to, to locate objects in the water column. Sperm whales have, uh, however, this tremendous capability that some people are postulating may be actually able to stun their prey um, and, and ability to communicate over, over large distances. Just the echolocation system in sperm whales seems to be built around an organ which is unique to sperm whales, and that is the spermaceti organ. And that, uh, that organ contains the substance which was sought after by Yankee whalers called the spermaceti oil, and, and hence the name sperm whales.